so tired. I'm trying to get back to working out in the morning, early morning. So I usually go to a cycling class in the morning time. I like to just try to work out between eight and 10. That's usually my schedule, but obviously because of uh, holidays, I was working out not at all. So trying to get back into it is a little difficult. So I go to an outdoor cycling class, which is really great because all the bikes are six feet apart and there's a lot of space. We are able to keep our mask off if you're in the back of the class. But again, because we're so social distance, it's I feel pretty safe doing it. And so I've been taking this class about two times a week and it's very convenient. Um, get my workout in. I really like cycling and I'm a class pass partner as well. So I'm gonna put my link below if you're wanting to sign up. Then usually when I come home, the first thing I like to do is light a candle. Or if I'm not working out that day, the first thing I usually do when I wake up is light a candle. I don't know what it is. It's just like self-care. It's literally the first thing I do. And it, for some reason, makes me feel so calm. So always light a candle. And then I usually just like to tidy up the living room because Sometimes stuff just be everywhere and I usually work in the living room space and I just cannot work in a space that is dirty or just feels like things are just all over the place. So I just do a little bit of dusting, some vacuuming, some wiping down of tables, etc, etc. Then I finally go and take a shower, wash my face, do my whole, you know, bathroom routine and I'm really take my morning skincare pretty seriously like you know I do all the steps wash my face tone etc etc and I'm gonna show the products that I usually use so these are the products that I use for this day but the the steps pretty much remain the same just the products kind of change a little bit so I use this first their new gentle milky cleanser pretty good this watermelon glow recipe toner Rael beauty glow chemistry serum an eye cream from Peter Thomas Roth and then this water drench moisturizer. So bomb. I just ran out and man. And then I like to go on with a jade roller just to help depuff my face. Once I'm done and I put on some regular clothes, I like to do my daily devotional, Bible study slash prayer. I'm trying to be more diligent with this. Like there was a point where I was doing it very consistently and then I guess I kind of fell off. But just trying to make daily prayer even if it's like a couple minutes in the morning part of my morning just to kind of set the tone for my day my faith is a big part of my life i'm just you know just making sure that i'm devoting time to it then finally i'm eating breakfast now i am not a breakfast person to be honest like preferably i won't but i feel like I need to start eating breakfast so i've been trying to make it a point to do that and here i'm making avocado toast because it's just easy straight to the point simple and i like the way my avocado toast tastes so <laughs> it's basic it's such a basic la girl thing but i don't care i don't care so i just mash those up and then i put in half a lemon i don't know it gives it a little zing a little pizzazz a little tang and then i also like to put pink himalayan salt in that just to again give it just a little bit of flavor i just don't like plain avocados like meh. and then i put that on toasted bread or i mash that all up and i put that directly on toasted bread uh, spread it out i usually just do one slice i thought i could do two and then realize like girl you're not that hungry you don't be eating breakfast remember <laughs> so i just spread it out on my toast and then i like to put the everything but bagel seasoning bomb 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 then i just do some turkey sausage patties and some fruit for today it was mangoes not from pavilions really good these mangoes were kind of expensive though but it's pre-cut and that's fine by me because i'm too lazy <laughs> then i like to make a coffee so i am planning to invest in a coffee maker very soon but in the meantime i use this stoke iced coffee really good has a nice level of sweetness I like to go on with the syrup so this one was salted caramel and then I put in like some heavy whipping cream kind of sort of but realized eh, that was a bit much I mean it wasn't bad I just think it was too much cream I didn't need that much cream I usually prefer my coffee not as pale <laughs> looking as that one looks but yeah that's pretty much it then I sit down I eat my breakfast and then I finally open my phone and go through social media I try to do these steps before I you know go through just because doing it 
like looking at my phone immediately just doesn't really set the tone for my day so anyway that is my very simple social distance morning routine i appreciate y'all for watching and i will catch y'all in my next video bye